Hi, Learned Justin here. Um, I've done a video before on my mini stabilizer for my camcorder, but uh, since I've filmed about 19 episodes of my vlog, Walking with Dave, I've uh, come up with a number of attachments for this little uh, stabilizer rig that I think you might be interested in. Now here's the rig with simply a mini ball mount here and a quick release here. Uh, that's how I usually uh, mount the camera. Uh, it's very now simple. By holding your elbows tight into your body, you can get an extremely steady shot with this little rig. You can uh, pretty much control the camera any way you want. Uh, works very well. Now, if that's not steady enough, you can take these handles off. I built a shoulder rig for it. Simply slips on exactly the same way. Uh, Mount it on your shoulder and you know for longer periods of time or if you wanted to use a DSLR on this uh, the shoulder rig would come in pretty handy. Uh, going back to the handheld uh, configuration uh, if I need to uh, use a microphone I have a uh, I can put it right here uh, this is a shotgun mic with a homemade dead cat made out of craft fur uh, it sits right here and uh, works very well. I've used it outside in extremely windy conditions and had no problem whatsoever. Now, when filming myself outside, I usually have to hold the uh, rig like this, but it's light. It doesn't, uh, it's not heavy enough to bother me. Uh, shots aren't that long, so uh, works real well. Although one thing I did run into, outside the glare on the LCD screen is uh, tremendous. What I did, I took a foam cooler can, a can cooler, and cut it down. And and that goes on like this. There's a piece of elastic here. Slide it over the uh, LCD screen like this. And it's enough of a hood that stops the glare and you can see uh, what you're filming pretty well. I'm probably going to be needing a light uh, for a documentary I'm going to be filming called the MR340 which is a 340 mile canoe race from Kansas City to St. Charles, Missouri. Some of that filming will be at night. I will probably need a light. I simply added the light on this end cap here. And another way I can use this, I bought a $5 skateboard, took three of the wheels off, and those wheels can go right on the bottom of the rig, just like this. So I can get, use it as a tabletop slider um, if I need to. I think it'll work great. I haven't tried that yet, but uh, I see no reason why that won't work. As a finishing touch, I added a SEMA quick release plate right here so I can mount the entire rig on a tripod if I need to uh, and release it quickly. So that's my mini rig. What in the heck? I don't know what he's doing. 